This morning, gentlemen, our efforts will be confined to arranging the necessary chills and feeble music for my new drama, Desperate Esma. As I unfold the plot of the play, you will be so kind as to interpolate the necessary incidental music. We will begin with curtain music suggestive of the sea. When the curtain goes up, there is a scene of a forest with a little stream running through it. That's very pretty indeed. And now that the curtain is up, the play will begin. Enter first, Rosamond, the village maid. No, 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 no. You didn't understand me. I said Rosamond, the village maid, not the village undertaker. The girl enters, sits on the stile, and awaits her lover, Claude. While waiting thusly all, unsuspecting of the danger which is lurking nigh, enter the villain. Not on a horse, just on his feet. The villain enters, sees the girl seated there, and says to her, Woman, be mine. So the girl shudders. Not a convulsion, Mr. Leader, just a shudder, and she speaks and says, What, be your wife, you monster? No! She don't fight him either. She just refuses him in a ladylike manner. The villain, not to be baffled, says, What, you refuse me, but I say you must and shall be mine. So the girl shudders again. That, gentlemen, is the plot of the drama, a pair of shudders. She does it just for a blind, so the villain takes her by the wrist and they struggle. Wait one moment, one moment. This is a struggle, not a wall. Play something a little more dramatic here, an agitato motif. That will do very nicely. Use that every time something dramatic happens. Now then, while this struggle is raging, and just as the villain is about to get the best of it, in comes the hero. That'll do, that'll do. You don't seem to get the idea of this thing at all. This is a hero who enters here, not a buck dancer. You have spoiled the best situation in the drama, where this chap runs on and says, Fear not, my Rosamond. I will save you. He knocks the villain down and says, You cur, I have foiled you. And just as the curtain comes down, the hero says to the villain, At last, you cur, love has triumphed and the girl is mine. One moment. That's four years later in the third act. 